Hello fellow Catholics, this is Sergio Becerra II, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. So we're back to the history of the Popes by Rupert Matthews. So in our last video, we finished off with Pope St. Alexander I. So now, today, we're now looking into the seventh Pope of Rome, Pope St. Sixtus I, from 116 AD to 125 AD. All right then, so... <coughs> Excuse me. This is another Pope with another short history. So let's look into it. Although his name is conventionally given as Sixtus, this Pope's real name was probably Zistus. X Y S T U S. Zistus. As this is the more correct Greek form of the name current at this date. Of all the early popes, Sixtus I is one of the most poorly known, although the later sources give his dates with apparent authority. They do not agree with each other. It is generally agreed, however, that he held office for 10 years during the reign of the Emperor Hadrian. The most important act attributed to St. Sixtus by the later historians is that it was he who introduced to the Mass, the Sanctus, a short hymn that in translation runs, Holy, 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 Lord God of hosts. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. So Sixtus the fourth is the one who came up with the Sanctus hymn, which we all uh, know from when we go to Mass. Sanctus, 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 Dominus Dios, Hosanna. Heaven and earth are full of your glory, Hosanna in the highest. We all hear that, whether in Latin or in other languages like English, which I have heard of both in both languages. So it looks like, six, so here Sixtus is the one who is credited for that hymn. The Sanctus is based in part on a verse from a from a, the Sanctus is the Sanctus is based in part on a verse from Isaiah in the Old Testament. The verse is recited during some Jewish rituals, ritual, some Jewish rituals, and some believe that the Sanctus is therefore derived from Judaic practice, which would make it an ancient part of Christian ritual. However, whether St. Sixtus truly introduced it or not is not known for certain. So they don't know. Okay, so even though, it's, even though it says here, it looks like Sixtus the first was the one who introduced the Sanctus hymn, but uh, not known for sure if he is credited for it. But I kind of believe it is Sixtus the first that did, that did present this uh, hymn. So once again, this is a, another, another Pope, um, of course, uh, with very little information. Again, I've done my research, and there's not that much information about Sixtus the First at this point. So, um, so tell me what you think in this uh, short video. Um, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell for future updates, and tell me what you think in the comments below. So this was Pope St. Sixtus I, the, was it, the, yeah, the seventh Pope, yeah, the seventh Pope of Alexander was, Alexander I was number, number six, but Sixtus I is number seven. All right, um, this wraps it up for this quick video, so uh, hope to see you soon with more videos to come. So have a blessed day. Take care now. Bye.